Mark, how long can that stay on 859? Is it longer than 60 seconds? Or? Okay, it's time to go. Call to order the uh, June meeting of the Oklahoma City Airport Trust. Item two is to receive a motion to approve the minutes of the May meeting. Okay, we have a motion and second. Record your votes. That's approved. Director's report. Thank you, uh, Mr. Vice Chair. I do have a small report uh, this morning. I, uh, since our last trust meeting is when we had the, the May 31st tornado, and the airport uh, did get impacted in, in, in quite a significant way with regard to damage in our operations that evening. Of course, we evacuated terminal, uh, the terminal and, and brought passengers into the tunnel. We had about 1,500 people in the tunnel, and we were there for about two hours. With regard to damage at the airport, um, Really, Clarence E. Page Airport and Wiley Post Airport uh, did not sustain any damage. However, Will Rogers had some straight line winds, uh, about 90 miles an hour, and, and we also think there were some circulations on airport property uh, evidenced by some of the damage. We're looking at probably estimates with a million and a half to two million dollars, but we are still finalizing those. Our field maintenance operation at 104th and Meridian took some uh, structural damage as well as a lot of equipment damage. The airport hotel sustained some damage, uh, hangars at AAR, several of them. The terminal roof had about five different penetrations and we're really awaiting estimates on those at this time. And then some of our other uh, tenants like U.S. Marshal Service, Mike Maroney Aeronautical Center had some roof damage. So um, the airport uh, did sustain some significant uh, uh, damage and, and we did get everybody weathered in uh, within 24 hours and that was good because we still had rain events that weekend. Uh, but we're going to move forward as quickly as we can uh, with our tenants and with our insurance and with FEMA and, and our own staff and contracts to repair these as quickly as possible. Thank you. Okay. Item 4 is Will Rogers World Airport. Thank you. Item A is to approve the Certificate of Substantial Completion with Downey Contracting LLC and accept the completed project for the Air Navigation Facility 1 Roof Replacement and Building Repairs Project. Item B is approved certificate of substantial completion with diversified construction of Oklahoma Incorporated. Accept the completed project for the Air Navigation Facility 2 roof replacement and building repairs project at Mike Monroney. Item C is approving change order number two to the contract with Downey Contracting LLC. This is for the flight standards building roof replacement and building repairs project <laughs> at Mike Maroney Aeronautical Center. This deducts $3,175 and adds 19 days. Item D is approving change order number two to the contract with diversified construction of Oklahoma Incorporated for the Hangar 3B South low roof replacement project adding 31 days. Item E is approving change order number two and amendment one to the contract with Do It Construction Company. This is for the FAA project we began last year to construct a perimeter road around our east parallel runway, adding 66 days and deducting $2,177.60 and accept the completed project. Item F is approve addendas one and two for the check baggage inspection system, uh, accept the staff recommendations on the bids, waiving any bid irregularities, Awarding the contract for the base bid and alternate number one to Terrace Global USA for $13,974,566. Also awarding the operations and maintenance services contract to Terrace Global USA Incorporated for two years uh, after final acceptance of the project for one million, uh, excuse me, yes, one million three thousand eight hundred sixty-six dollars per year, approving contract and bond subject to review. Item G is approving the change order number six with ResTech Incorporated. This is for our garage A and B rehabilitation <laughs> project, adding $11,757.10 in seven days. Item H is approved addendum number one to the request for bids for the operations and maintenance of automated teller machines, receiving the recommendation regarding the bids and awarding agreements to MidFirst Bank and Bank of America North America. I is to adopt the resolution closing the designated smoking room in the uh, terminal at Will Rogers Airport effective September 1st, 2013. Item J is adopt the joint resolution of the airport trust and the council of the city of Oklahoma City expressing intent for the trust to issue taxable revenue bonds for the financing and construction of its consolidated rental car facility and necessary related capital expenditures. 
And last, item K is to approve a public utility easement dedication by the city of Oklahoma City, and this is in uh, conjunction with the Portland Avenue relocation project, specifically south of Southwest 104th Street in Cleveland County. That's all items under Will Rogers. Okay. Do we have a motion? Okay. Okay. Any comments or questions on the items under Will Rogers World Airport? Okay. Hold your votes. That's approved unanimously. Item five. Under general item A is to receive the delinquent accounts receivable report, construction project status report, and the budget to actual report. Item B is approving amendment number two to the agreement with Oklahoma Roofing and Sheet Metal LLC for the 2012 annual roof repairs and maintenance contract, we're adding $200,000 mainly to uh, due to addressing the storm damage that we've had to deal with the last couple of weeks. Item I is, uh, for, or excuse me, item C is for the similar reason, amendment number one to the agreement with diversified construction uh, of Oklahoma, uh, adding $100,000 to the 2012 annual miscellaneous services and repairs contract. Item D is approving the agreement with the city of Oklahoma City, compensating uh, city uh, employees with public works for the project selection services that they provide the airports department. Item E is adopting the resolution ratifying the director's actions in the determination of an emergency condition and waiving competitive bidding for emergency repairs to secure property and equipment due to the damage caused by the weather conditions on May 20th and May 31st of 2013. That's all items under general. Okay. Any questions or comments on uh, item five? A motion? <coughs> so moved. Okay. Record your votes. That's approved unanimously. Number six. Under leases, item A is to accept the assumption agreement and use guarantee for the sale of T-Hanger Unit 308 from Jerry D. Renfro to Jerry D. Renfro 1997 Revocable Trust as provided by the lease agreement with PWA Incorporated. Item B is approving a ground services agreement with Tabani OKC Crown Plaza LLC doing business as Crown Plaza Oklahoma City. This is for a courtesy vehicle commencing retroactive to May 1st at Will Rogers World Airport. Item C is approving a surface use agreement and memorandum of agreement with Barron Exploration Company Incorporated pertaining to their agreement to establish a drilling site on the airport property at Wiley Post and restricting the use to the surface of one well uh, being drilled and also establishing surface damage rates. Item D is approving Supplement 7 to the lease agreement with OM Hospitality LLC. This amends certain provisions of the lessee's financing and assignment of its leasehold interest also consenting to Prosperity Bank as the mortgagee of the lessee's leasehold interest, approving the estoppel agreement at Will Rogers World Airport. Item E is approving the supplement number two to Corporate Hangar Lease Agreement with Chesapeake Land Development Company, LLC. This confirms the date of the additional facility that was constructed some time back, establishes, establishes the primary term of the agreement extending through December 31st of 2022 also confirms square footage facilities and the lease premises itself and establishing ground rental rates. Item F is a, a complimentary item to the Chesapeake uh, hangar lease. This approves supplement number four to their self-fuel uh, storage facilities agreement uh, that runs coterminous with the lessee's hangar lease. And that's all the items under leases. Okay, we have a motion? Okay, record your votes. Approved unanimously. Mark, you're on the roll. Okay, item seven. Do we have a motion on that? Second. Okay. Record your votes. That's approved unanimously. Are there any comments from trustees or staff or citizens? Trustees first. Any comments? Okay. Any comments from staff? Any comments from the public? 